Hello, and welcome back to Tea with Tracy, coming to you live every Tuesday at 12, spilling relevant tips, trends, and talk in all things real estate and home ownership related. Today, we're continuing on with our series, Local Business Spotlights. And today we have a special guest, Molly Lalone, director of the Lake Orion Downtown Development Authority. She's going to be coming on and joining us today to talk about what's happening in downtown Lake Orion for the holiday season. There are some favorites from past seasons that will be back again and a new surprise coming to the downtown. So shortly, we'll get Molly on to join us. In the upcoming weeks, we have some great guests. We have um, Holly Germati coming on next week to talk about how to simplify your holiday season. Oat Soda's coming up later this month. Um, so, And then plenty of other local businesses coming on in December as well. So I see we have Molly on the live with us. Let's get her to join us. Yay. Hi, how are you, Molly? I'm doing well, Tracy. Thank you for inviting me to tea today. Great. Well, thank you for joining me and joining us. I'm so glad that you could join us today. Um, there's, I, I was mentioning there are some exciting things happening in downtown Lake Orion this holiday season. Some of our you know, traditional favorites that have been around for a while. And we have a new surprise that you're going to let everybody know about today. So, um, so thank you for joining us. Um, Molly has been the director of uh, our DDA in downtown Lake Orion for quite some time. So you may recognize her friendly face when you see her around town and at our events. Um, so what do we have going on this holiday season in downtown Lake Orion? Well, the holiday season starts in two days. We've yeah. got the sand stroll um, tree lighting events happening. This year, we've had so much um, interest in participation. Um, we've got the Lake Orion High School Choir coming. We have, um, I'm so excited that about that. That is exciting. Yes. And um, we've got, you know, Santa will be there. He's mm -hmm. always um, interested in, in uh, taking part in the events in Lake Orion because he knows there's lots of good boys and girls here in town. So yes. he wants to make sure he does hide all of them. Absolutely. Um, we also have a Boy Scout troop. It's a uh, Boy Scout Troop 234. Um, they're going to come in and they're going to run our fire pits and they're going to roast marshmallows for oh. everybody. I'm so excited about I that. love that. I love the community involvement with the Boy Scout troop and with the choir from the high school. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, it truly is a community event. If you haven't been to this tree lighting ceremony in past years, you definitely want to check it out this year. It is so much fun. It really puts you in a festive mood. Even if you're not ready for Christmas mm -hmm. and the holidays, it's just like, it's just got a great feeling, a great feeling yeah. to be there. So Yes. We have a snow machine this year, so we are oh. making our own pretty fluffy snow um, for people to take pictures in front of. You know, it can yes. sprinkle in like a snow globe in front of you. Um, we've got Broadway Dance have a surprise for everybody. We're not exactly sure. I mean, because it's a surprise, so I don't want to say too much. But yeah. Broadway Dance is coming. And we are going to have some carolers. Um, we'll have a DJ. There's going to be sing-along. Um, there's a hot cocoa bar. Um, and Shaded Bloom is um, helping us. Um, they have just opened in 20 Front Street. So okay. If you haven't met Shaded Bloom yet, they're going to bring their hot cocoa down to us. Right. Um, and that's, so that's what's happening in the park. But guess what? Wow. Across the street from the park where Bitter Tom's is, we're going to have horse and carriage rides. Yay! <laughs> That's Tom is a major sponsor for that. Um, the DDA said, okay, I understand where you're going, Molly, but you got to get the sponsorship money to make this happen because it's really expensive. Right. Um, and Bitter Tom said, hey, I can see the vision in this. I want to see horses and carriages in downtown oh. and let's park everybody north of town and bring them in. That's going to be so much fun. Oh, so, it is. Um, and what a nostalgic feel it's going to I mean, we already have a really great historic downtown but yet with a modern feel to it so to bring in the horse and carriage rides oh that's mm -hmm. going to be magical really yes so. it's going to be magical yep. so it starts thursday november 18th but then from then on it'll be fridays and saturdays 
from 5 p.m. until 8 p.m. Okay. So everybody um, come downtown and park on the north end of town by the old high school okay. where you live, Tracy. Park yep. Over- by the <laughs> Eman <laughs> Center. Yep. <laughs> park by my house. Yeah. Right. The, the, by Tracy the driveway goes then... to the highest bidder, though. <laughs> my best client <laughs> wins the driveway spot. So. <laughs> Yay. Well, that's, yeah. I think that's a good promotion. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then um, ride the... Um, ride the horse and carriage through town. Um, I would ride, you know, a couple times and then stop at Bitter Tongues. Yes, absolutely. Um, so we can walk around and shop and dine and enjoy. We have comments That's coming in, Sawdust and Cider. They're so excited for the horses. Yeah. We are too. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So we um, went free pizza bar, also um, supported this, and we have a McKenna, um, they supported, we have a lot of um, sponsors. It Lots took quite a few sponsors to make this happen. It so. takes a village. It really does. It takes a village. I'm so excited. Um, yeah, that's, this is a great addition. I, I think my son and I will probably go do that this weekend because how fun. <laughs> yes, <very laughs> I rem- fun. Yeah. Years ago, we did have years and years ago, we did have, it was just a one-time thing, some horse and carriage rides when my girls were small and that's still a fun picture and memory. Like they were like, Oh, remember when we got to do that? So whether you have younger kids, older kids, you're an adult. I I mean, it's just, Mm -hmm. it really does create some great memories. So. And that's, you know, that's what downtowns are about. They're about making family um, memories. I mean, at least in Lake Orion, that's certainly what we're trying to do. We're trying to create um, great family memories. Um, if your cherished memories are in a certain place, it's very hard to imagine that place going away. So this is um, both for the future of the downtown and for just for creating great memories for everybody. We want this to be a cherished place for everyone. Absolutely. Um, Yes. Oh, so exciting. So yeah, so we're kicking it off. We're kicking everything off on Thursday with the sing and stroll and that six to eight um, in Children's Park. And and then every weekend, we're going to have horse and carriage rides uh, Fridays and Saturdays from five to eight. Um, except right the first weekend in, in December, there won't be horse and carriage rides because we have another fun event that's going to be coming through downtown. Right. And that yes. is the oh, holiday lady parade is back. back. Um, I tell you that um, the team that puts together for the parade, they tried so hard to make it happen last year. And it just, um, you know, uh, circum- world circumstances took over. Yep. But it's back and it's back with a vengeance. We are um, so excited to have the parade coming back into downtown. Um, and we're looking forward to, to everybody uh, coming down and joining us for that celebration. Yes. Um, but I wanted to tell you, there's Shop Small Saturday is right after Thanksgiving. It's the first Saturday after Thanksgiving. And we are going to have, um, again, we'll have a hot cocoa bar down um, in town. And we're giving away, we've got bags that we're giving away. And, um, and you know, and they're going to have goodies in them. There's going to be um, a gift guide um, put together by the downtown merchants. And they've got some specials in there that you can only get if you get that guide. So yeah. um, make sure you stop by between 10 and two and find our booth. So you can um, enjoy all those specials and yes. we've got stores. They're, they're opening early. They're Ooh. staying open. Early. They're just so excited about shop small Saturday. So it's, and it um, really, it's, it's, it's a great day. So my girls mm-hmm. um, last year, before they went off to college, they worked at green hippo gifts in downtown Lake Orion. And um, actually they're going to be coming back for the holiday season. And it's just like, my daughter said she was in town this weekend. Um, one of them that goes to Michigan, she said, you know what? She's like, green, like being in the shops, being in the downtown shops, it just feels like Christmas. Like it gets you in the mood. Like the excitement is there. There's just a great vibe throughout the downtown. Um, so, you know, I know a lot of people are big fans of black Friday, but my favorite is shop small Saturday, our local business owners. I mean, they have so many unique and creative gifts and I mean, there's, you can find something for everyone. So Absolutely. Yeah. And, and Absolutely. like you said, there's, you can win, um, you can, there's special deals, you can win prizes. And, um, I know you said you're going to be doing the, the shopper card again this year. I know last mm-hmm. year I was uh, on a mission to fill my bingo card. So <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got that right in front of me here. It's going to start. We'll have, um, we will have a limited number that we will give out on Thursday, November 18th as our, okay. an early bird. Okay. Um, and then the rest of them, 
you can get on Shop Small Saturday and you can get them at our booth and we'll have um, a few in each of the stores as well. Okay. And that's going to go through the end of the year. Um, so when you make a purchase at a store, so you spend $25 in a store, you're going to get a stamp. You have to keep your receipt and bring, um, once you have four of them, you bring it to the DDA and we verify that they're all separate um, receipts and qualify. And then we give you a prize. And for every four times you, um, you have a purchase and fill up your squares, you get something new. So the first set of four, you get um, Dragon Dollars, which are our holiday version of Downtown Dollars. It's um, good, at, as same as cash and participating businesses all over downtown. And then um, you'll get some Lake Orion swag for the next four, and then $25 for the next four, and then a mystery bonus at the end. All right. So fun. It's yes. fun. If you're in downtown, you might as well play our game. <laughs> Absolutely. I mean, if you're going to come, you're going to do your shopping downtown. Um, you can get some added bonuses. I know those dragon dollars were really fun for after the holidays then. Um, got to treat my kids to, you know, different little surprises in downtown and some meals out with, uh, you know, for I was already going to be doing my shopping anyway, so it's a great promotion. Mm -hmm. And if you weren't thinking of doing your shopping downtown, here's another reason to come and do it. You'll get some added added bonuses and surprises. So yeah, yes, absolutely. So. Yeah. Uh, Thank you for uh, inviting me. I've been so it's so nice to be able to talk about Lake Orion. Yes. And all the things that we've got planned. Well, thank you so much for joining us. And we do have one more event. I know it's not DDA sponsored, but in the past, the DDA has helped coordinate. And of course, the DDA supports all the businesses and events. And that will be the, we believe, the New Year's resolution run um, on, yeah. on New Year's Day. So Hanson's um, Running Shop, if you have an interest in participating. I know the, the track goes past my house. So um, I do see there's people who walk, jog, run. I mean, there's, you know, parents out there with the babies in the stroller. Um, that's a really fun it's a event. It yeah. is. It's a tradition. <laughs> it, it definitely is. It definitely is. It's so fun. Again, again, we do so many things, um, you know, in downtown Lake Orion that just bring such a great vibe, a great feeling. Um, the energy is always so high. It's very exciting. Um, it really is a great place to live. So, but thank you, Molly. Thank you for all that you do for supporting our downtown and the businesses. Thank you all for tuning in. Be sure to check out the Sing and Stroll this Thursday and on November 18th. Be sure to check out the horse and carriage rides throughout the season. Um, the lighted holiday parade. Shop small Saturday. It's the last Saturday in, in November. It's the Saturday after Thanksgiving. Um, so be sure to check it all out. And uh, thank you all for tuning in. We'll see you next Tuesday on Team with Tracy. Thanks, Molly. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.